Welcome everybody to our Tome RPG news update for the month of September 2019. For this update, we'll be giving our quarter three progress report for the Terrain of Magical Expertise's production. But first, yes, it's another special announcement. Today marks two whole years since we launched our original Kickstarter campaign and managed to raise over $111,000 thanks to the incredible 1,591 backers who donated. Of the 150 backer enemies from the combined $200 opponent tier and $350 special opponent tiers, we still have two open slots left, which means, you guessed it, a new opportunity to get your character featured in the completed game. This time, we'll be doing something very simple, a giveaway. Click the link in the description below to be taken to our Gleam page, where you can enter by inputting your email address. The contest will run for one week, ending next Monday, October 7th at 12 noon Pacific Standard Time. After that, a random winner will be selected and contacted via the email address they provided. They'll be sent the assignment of rights contract all backers have been previously given, and their prize will be a fully animated enemy character to appear in Tome, equivalent to the $200 opponent reward tier from the original Kickstarter. As with the fan art contest we did back in March of this year, we humbly request that any original backers of the $500, $350, and $200 reward tiers please respectfully not enter the contest, as we'd like to give other fans a chance to be part of the game. However, $90, $60, $50, and $30 tier backers are allowed and encouraged to enter. To quickly go over some of the details yet again, just in case you don't know them by this point, your character can either be a caricature of yourself, an original character, or a fan character converted into the style of the Tome world. Again, the winner of the giveaway will be contacted via the email address they entered with and sent an assignment of rights contract to allow us permission to use their character or likeness in the game. In that contract, we'll ask you to provide a written description and or provide any reference images to work off of so we can bring your character to life properly. Remember, the event will be over by next Monday, October 7th at 12 noon Pacific Standard Time, so keep an eye on your inbox that day in case you might be the lucky winner. Now, on to the update. We've accomplished quite a bit in the last few months, so let's go over some of the milestones we've hit. First, a quick and easy one. The dojo and shop features are now fully functional. You can battle against all four of the Dojo Master characters, provided by some of our $500 tier backers, in order to gain a new special technique for the White Hat Hacker and you can buy items from both the stores and hub towns and the traveling merchants and stages. Next, 75% of the balance pass on the statistics for all enemies in the game has been roughed out. This means we'll soon be able to start playtesting the difficulty curve for each of the major and minor battles in the main scenario of the game. As mentioned last time, this will likely get revised a couple times in order to find the right middle ground of fairness and challenge. Next, all of the party members' team attacks are fully functional. So now each combination of all the playable characters in the Dandy Alliance can now combine their forces to perform a super move with incredible results. In addition, only a small handful of the player characters' techniques are left to program. Now here's a big one I'm very relieved I managed to get done so quickly. All of the in-game cutscenes for the entire main story scenario have been roughly choreographed. This is particularly big because now all of the events that progress the story have been integrated and set up in their appropriate levels. The refining process of this aspect will definitely require tweaking over time, but this being finished is arguably just as important as having completed all of the animation for the visual assets of the game. Last but not least, here's an exciting one. Production has begun on the game's fully animated ending sequence. This is in accordance with the $100,000 stretch goal we reached during the Kickstarter, but it gets better. More fully animated cutscenes, in addition to the promised ending sequence, will be added for some key moments in the game. In fact, several of them have already been completed within just the last month. I hope you look forward to seeing them. That's it for now, but next month we'll be talking about the fourth and final region of the Tome world, and revealing its respective Net King too. Good luck to all the entrants of the giveaway, and thanks as always for watching. We'll see you in October.